Hey. Look. Pick up your phone, I need your attention My girl so bad, we call her detention I am so glad we moved beyond friendship I am so glad your mama liked me Sweat up with Cupid, told her fight me I stole your love <sighs> Hi guys I've tanned so much Can you guys tell? No one can try to tell me I'm white Finally But it only lasts a few months in the air though Soon I'll go back to being accused for being a blackfish Anyway I literally cannot stop yawning, so forgive me. But I just woke up from a nap, so like, really and truly, I wouldn't even be talking to anyone right now, but <laughs> I'm being nice to you by actually communicating. Um, I'm gonna do my hair. I know it's late. Ew, I look like a caveman. I hate when like I don't look pretty and then I have my hair down. I just feel like so collapsed. Um, but I'm gonna put it in two braids because that keeps the moisture and even though the curls are looking great, as you can see, but um, I'm not doing anything with my hair right now, so me just leaving it like this isn't really doing anything. Right. I don't know, y'all! Oh. I feel like I look like a man right now, and it's actually disturbing me incredibly. Hey, hell. I'm using... I'm so sorry. I'm using the... Cantu Leaving Conditioning Cream. My hairstyles and stuff that I would do on Instagram, like I feel like I was just taking away valuable time that I could have been, oh, I could have been spending filming. Right now, I'm very dedicated to my YouTube, and that's like my main. This is castor oil. My main um, concern, if that makes sense. Like that's my main grind right now. And also, since we're on the topic. I've been making a lot of serious videos right now, recently, um, but as you can see by this video, I'm not doing any more for the meantime. I need to be entertaining in funny aspects, not just in those aspects. I feel like I'm both, like, I can get you a girl that can do both. Um, I can entertain and be funny and, you know, joke about, but I can also bring on the serious side and that's kind of like my vibe of this channel but for right now i'm going to be focusing on funny light-hearted videos um especially since we're in quarantine i just want to make people laugh like i've kind of realized that not that like i regret making the videos i've made because it has really engaged a lot of people um and I, i'm not going to stop doing them obviously but every now and then i just need to like brighten it up a little bit and just you know make people laugh that was my little flowery rant about whatever meaningless nothings um oh my <sighs> should we cue in the um 2013 music come out <laughs> are messing up my schedule here but i'll just let you it's fine i'm always like chilled in my bed by at least at least 11 and you guys are making me face the world enough okay right we are going to do my night routine there's a lot of things i do from my skin like depending on the day depending on the day depends on what i focus on on my skin whether it's like Getting out of the impurities, moisturising, exfoliating, whatever. Oh, this is African Black Soap from this brand. Sky Organics. And it comes in this massive thing that you cut up, little piece of soap. And it lasts you, like, two years. I don't have naturally nice skin. I have really bad acne. My skin, not bad, but it's, like, moderate. And my skin's really greasy. And I have really large pores. But then my skin's combination as well and gets really, really dry. So... It's just all discombobulated. But I'm on acne medication and I've been on acne medication for like years now. But um, I was running out so I wasn't using it too much. It's like the cream, acne cream on my face. But I was running out so when I got some back like from the doctors, basically it takes a while for your skin to get used to it again. So your, your skin goes really dry. So my skin's been like itching, itching and burning, itching and burning, itching and burning. <laughs> So um, I need to just like moisturise it as much as possible and also because I've been like tanning and stuff 
um, you've got to make sure your skin's moisturised, otherwise your skin will peel. So, oh. So right now, I've been using my Ethiopian Honey Deep Nourishing Mask from the Body Shop. I love the Body Shop stuff. It's like a moisturising mask. Like, it actually makes my skin feel like a baby's bum. And I just leave it on there for as long as I want. Like, it's like conditioner for my skin. Like, I'll just probably leave it on all night until I go to wash it off, like, late, late, late at night. Rinse off after five to ten minutes. <laughs> um, they don't make the rules here, I do. Anyway, you guys probably don't care, but you guys keep asking me. Skincare routine, skincare routine, skincare routine. Oh. <coughs> <coughs> Whoa. I don't want to get copyrighted by listening to music on here, but, like, if it happens, then so be it, you know? Because I really want to listen to Katy Perry. The, the all-nighter, clip B. I'm not saying that all night, you dumb. This is, this is evening. I just love Katy Perry so much. Oh, so crazy right now should i do it i bought this a plat to know how to plat and i still don't know how to plat she is um my pride and possession my joy and happiness right what should we do with your hair then babe you're looking a bit crusty and dusty um right bear with me gonna get the hair stuff we're gonna fix this girl up welcome to the led salon so today we have my model here today is this beautiful Latoya Bobblehead Quisha. She is letting me do her hair today. I will be very gentle with it. And uh, have it relaxing. Let's go. Okay. Right. Okay. <laughs> Done. I actually, <laughs> I feel like I would just be so violent with my kid's hair, like. I just imagine myself just being that really rough black mum with their kid's hair and like I won't even try to do it, it will just happen. What am I doing? Honestly, I pray for my children because I cannot do other people's hair to save my life. Not to mention the bobblehead Quisha does not stay still. She's just slithering around and it is really irritating. That's your problem for not having a body mate. Do we try again? Or do we just not try? I think we have to try. Never give up, John Cena. Do I try and plait? I cannot plait to save my life. She just keeps moving, that's the problem. Maybe if she didn't move so much, I would be good at plaiting by now. But no, she just moves around like she just doesn't want me to learn. I'm actually doing it. I'm very proud of myself. I didn't think that was gonna go very well. I mean, it's not, it's not neat, don't get me wrong. Don't even think that for one second that it's a neat plait. But at least it's a plait, you know? You guys can't even see because stop moving she's actually like a toddler having a tantrum grow up because you're just so difficult like i just oh, I can't get with that. second plat done that was actually not too bad like i know i'm not good at platting but like i actually did it like i know it's not neat but i did it you know and i wasn't i wasn't really trying obviously i didn't care about her don't tell her that um i heard you shut up okay right now we're gonna tie it at the bottom. I think I'm allergic to like plastic. Her hair is like an allergy to me. No wonder why we don't get along. Like I actually am looking for a new girlfriend at this point. Her hair has been looking so crusty for like two years now. It's about time that I treat her. Stay, just like cooperate, please. She's 
so difficult. Oh my god. I feel like that's not too bad. And then we'll like, we'll twist it and do a little bun. No, I'll put that in the ponytail. Because when I put it in the bun, it just makes it look stupid. Oh no, no, no. Look at this, what is that? It looks like Nicole TV. Right, anyway. We got matching tattoos. Talk about a future. Whoa. I had to turn her around because she scares me. Okay, it's currently 2 a.m. Is that like a spot coming through? You are not about to see that. You're not. I think that's a spot that's already come and gone. It better be because I've had enough. Um, I've been on FaceTime with my friends for like two hours, two, three hours. Um, I'm not that tired, surprisingly. I don't really know what to do. Like, honestly, what do I even do? Should we do... Um, step by step drawing okay we're gonna try and draw a lion now guys this may be very boring to you guys but i'm actually very intrigued and if i can draw this lion i used to be quite good at art so like let's see if i've still got it in me this looks like a lion what's your favorite animal i think my favorite animal is um <laughs> i sound i sound like an old guy <laughs> on a tv show like daytime television i don't like animals let me just get that straight i know people are gonna be like what you don't like animals don't touch me animals can like stay cute from far away but don't get onto me apart from like a couple don't don't come around me with a smelly dog whatever no but um if i had to choose an animal that i like Llamas. I really like llamas. If you know me from very long, you know that my Instagram account used to be cheesy llamas. I love llamas a lot. Alpacas are cuter than llamas, but I like the word llamas more for some reason. So I wish alpacas names were llamas and llamas names were alpacas. Because if you look at the difference between them, alpacas are like adorable and like, I just want to cuddle them so much. I'm allergic to dogs and cats. Like, I feel like that just really makes sense because they just smell like honestly like i i think they're cute and all but like i don't actually think dogs sh like should smell if i go into your house and i smell your dog before i see it that's cancelled i'm done i shouldn't be able to smell your frowsy dog up in your house before i even see his tail wagon that is so stupid clean your pets and that's why i wouldn't want a dog i always think like oh my gosh I would want a dog because like, I could go on walks with it and stuff. But then realistically, like, I have to pick up its poo. Are you dumb? <laughs> no. I feel like cats are, like, actually evil. And cats, like, seem like they just would, like, mess your life up completely. Because I heard that, like, cats, like, don't actually care about you. They're just living off of you. Which is kind of a mood. But, like, why would I want that in my house? Like, I want to talk on this, actually. Because it's been weighing on my mind a lot. And I brought it up in my last video, I think about Lana Del Rey and that whole situation of her running her mouth on her typewriter. Um, that was shambles and I actually am so baffled that she even had the nerve to post that. Because what I find so funny is that like she was just saying how she feels like she should be able to like put out whatever music she feels like putting out. Okay, great. Why you gotta call out other people for their success on getting awards? Like, I think that really just shows her jealousy. Like, it doesn't come off good and, like, she's on about feminism and how feminism isn't made for her because people don't look like her. First of all, you're a white middle-class woman called Elizabeth and you think that people don't look like you. Get that out of your head right now. Um, I finished, oh, I finished stage one. Calling out people just to get your point across and starting the whole paragraph with other people's names. It's really just because they won awards and she didn't. Like, I don't listen to her music anyway. Like, all I know is Summertime Sadness, and I had to be reminded that was her song because that was however many years ago, and it's kind of relevant to me now. And, like, the whole Doja Cat situation, oh my gosh. I haven't looked at her statement, though, and what she said about it, but I don't care. Like, I do care, but, like, for right now, I'm too busy drawing a lion. Yeah, I mean, it's not great. Not one bit. It looks like a year five drew it. Like, a really talented year f three, two. The face isn't that bad, but it's just the main i didn't really try um yeah should i make a four no i can't bother i can't bother. i'm not doing that lol 
Um, I think I'm gonna make a four. I've never made a four, even when I was a kid, I don't think I've ever made a four. I don't think this is a four I have. I mean, if this video doesn't go up, then clearly it was. We could invite the toy bobblehead cliche in there, but I don't think she really wants to talk to me right now. Because I, like, embarrassed her earlier. I'll ask her anyway. Do you want to come in the four? I'm sorry. Being horrible. Okay, so this is from the outside, the way it looks like. And then inside... Oh, that was hard to do. I feel like that's enough of an all-nighter for me. Like, I actually feel like I've done an all-nighter. Like, I don't do this very often. We've done a lot. It's had this... I thought you guys died, but it was just my laptop. But I'm feeling very hot inside of here. I'm very claustrophobic. And why did I just put it, put it to sleep? <sighs> oh, anyway, um, I'm going to go now. I love you guys so much. Yeah, night.